which quadrant contains no solution to the system made out of these two linear inequalities right here. To graph that, it's just as if it was a normal linear equation. It's already in slope intercept form. So that's going to start at one, go up to over one. And to determine which way to shade, we can use a test point. I always choose zero, zero. And that is a false statement. So that means that we are going to shade above that line because zero, zero is false. Let's go to the other equation now and graph it the same way. We're going to start at negative one and that's up one over two. And we can use the same test point. I always like to use zero, zero. As long as that's not on the line, you can use that. That's going to produce a true statement, which means that we are shading above that blue dotted line right here. That gray area, the darkened region only goes through quadrants one, two, and three. Questions asking which one contains no solution. Let her see. Throw a like and a subscribe and I will see you on the next episode. Peace.